Is being very shy and just just showing nostrils there's some hippo nostrils back to the saddle ball there so the question was was it a male or a female bit far from it so that might be quite difficult. I'll move around to the other side and see if we can get a slightly closer look for you. It is a bit difficult at that distance. a better view of the, the stalk. Sorry guys, I'm having a bit of trouble with my earpiece. Seems that I've made a plan. Well done, Karen and well done, Karen and Icy, for the first to get it right. Um, it is a female. Uh, she has a yellow eye. 
I'm at, let me see, uh, Look here. So a female has a yellow eye, a male has a brown eye, the male also has a little set of yellow wattles um, that you can't see in this book but that hang down from the side. So well done to Karen and RC. from Syracuse. Lisa would like to know if there are any updates on the crocodile um, that was seen recently and would it have been in this dam. Uh, Lisa, it wasn't in this dam, but that's not to say the crocodile might not come to this dam. Uh, the last update on that crocodile is we followed its tracks and it crossed east over our eastern boundary, um, but it was at Buffalo's Hook Dam. Again, I think I'm going to head down towards Twin Dams, maybe those elephants have moved around there, and then before the end of drive we'll try and come back uh, to check up on those lions, make sure they haven't moved too far. just purely scavengers. Well, Charlene, hyenas actually do hunt quite a lot for themselves, depending on the area. And quite often, um, as a clan, they have a higher success rate uh, at hunting than uh, lions and leopards do. So they do initiate their own kill. I've seen hyenas kill, um, I've seen a big clan of hyenas kill buffalo. I've seen them kill hippos, so not only small things. And uh, they are actually very, very adept hunters. Obviously they use a very different style of hunting from lion and leopard. Um, and especially with the way their body's designed, they're designed for stamina. Um, and they can sort of tire out animals. So they're very success they are, can be very successful hunters. Good morning, Diane. Uh, Diane would like to know we saw that hyena take away that impala skull this morning. Uh, Dan would like to know when to take it back to the den the young ones to practice on. I don't think so, Dan. I think they was just moving off to, to eat it somewhere where the other hyena wasn't going to bother it. But I, I don't think it would have taken that back to the den for the young ones to practice on.
I think the cold season's arrived. Finally. Good morning, Catherine from Texas. Uh, Catherine would like to know, do we get any primates in the reserve? Uh, yes, Catherine, we do. Sorry, Catherine. So Catherine wanted to know if we get any primates. Uh, Catherine, I'll be back with you uh, in a second. I'll, and uh, 